Now, your KSBW weather forecast with meteorologist Gina DeVecchio. Good Sunday evening, everyone. Take a look in Carmel Highlands where you can see the cloud cover there. We have been seeing clouds hugging the coastline in many locations, but we did see some clearing around Monterey into Salinas. Now you can see it's a little smoky and we're seeing the return of the marine layer and we have temperatures in the low 60s, but it is a little breezy. You can see that coming in from the northwest 13 miles per hour. So we have been seeing a bit of a breeze for today, but good news pushing that smoke out of here. I haven't seen this many green dots on here since we started showing this about two weeks ago when those fires broke out. So very good conditions around here. Even the Santa Cruz Mountains. I had a few people on Facebook telling me that they got home to Felton and not only was their home there, thank goodness, but also that the air quality was good. So that's great to see those improvements. Unfortunately, in San Jose and much of the Bay Area, they've been seeing moderate to poor conditions. But around the Central Coast, we've had a pretty nice day. Now, it did warm up in the Santa Cruz Mountains, only in the mid to upper 70s, though. Cool near the coast, 66 for Santa Cruz, 61 for Aptos. So that chill in the air, the clouds hugging that coastline, Watsonville and Prunedale, 66 degrees. And then it only got as warm as 86 in Morgan Hill. Now, that's relatively mild uh, compared to where we could be this time of of year and looks like where we will be uh, in the, the t next week or so. Temperatures down the Salinas Valley, that northwest breeze keeping it in the upper 70s to near 80. And around the Monterey Peninsula, look at that, a little cool in Pebble Beach and Carmel stuck under that cloud cover. 77 for Carmel Valley and 72 in Monterey. That's where we saw most of the sunshine today. That clouds uh, hugged right around a marina or so, but many parts of marina into seaside saw sunshine today. And then you can see we started off with cloud cover in the morning. And I do expect that again. We're going to start to see a bit of a shallower marine layer, though, over the next few days. And then we're also going to be seeing drier conditions. So that's going to be one main change that we're seeing. As for this evening, uh, we have the marine layer near the coast influencing those temperatures. It's 61 in Santa Cruz now. Breeze still uh, coming in steady off the water. And there you can see 15 mile per hour winds down the valley. So a little breezy. Want to take a look at the fire positions and the wind that we'll see tomorrow. First of all, we'll start off with clouds uh, for the morning. This doesn't show it extending all the way down the Salinas Valley, but I think it may go a little farther south than what this is indicating. And then as we go through tomorrow, you notice those clouds near the coast. And then by the afternoon, that should uh, shift out and move out to sea. But I still think some spots, especially the northern areas, may be seeing a little bit more of that uh, cloud cover than some of the southern areas. As for tonight, we are seeing temperatures very similar to where we've been in the 50s. Uh, inland looking a little clearer in some spots like down the Salinas Valley and then you can see those temperatures lots of 70s and 60s I think a little cooler in the northern parts of the Monterey Bay uh, and of course we still have impact days because there are still areas of smoke and that's going to continue until the, all the fires are put out and look at that Labor Day, Labor Day. <laughs> I know right around the corner weather looks like it is going to be warming up for that for the unofficial uh, finish of summer but it's going to be feeling summer like okay cool thanks Gina mm -hmm.